Before knowing about HLA that is human leukocyte antigen we need to know about MHC which is major histocompatibility complex Now first take the term histocompatibility it refers to the quality of being tissue compatible Now this term is used in transplantation to describe the ability of a donor's tissue or organ to be accepted by a recipient These are the group of genes present in all animals known as the major histocompatibility complex which is MHC In humans the MHC is simply called human leukocyte antigen that is HLA So till now what we came to know is the human leukocyte antigens are the human form of MHC and these are the proteins located on the surface of white blood cells and other tissues in the body Now let's look at some questions The major histocompatibility complex includes genes that encode which of the following proteins To figure out the answer don't you think we require to know the genes which encode MHC First we need to remember that in humans the MHC region occurs on the chromosome number 6 Now if we look at these images we can find that the most of the options given in the questions are the proteins encoded by the MHC In option D the protein 21 hydroxylase is encoded by the MHC class 3 genes which lie between class 2 and class 1 region The last option HLAL is a pseudogene and it is affiliated with the ink RNA class. So the proteins which are encoded by the MHC genes are HLAA, HLADR, TAP1 and 21 hydroxylase but not HLAL. Let's come to the next question. Which of the following distinguishes the MHC class 1 from MHC class 2 antigens? To know the answer of this question, we need to know some facts about these classes. MHC class 1 and class 2 antigens are encoded by genes in different regions of the MHC. MHC class 1 antigens are expressed on the surface of all cells, whereas MHC class 2 antigens are largely restricted in expression to antigen presenting cells and endothelial cells. Both MHC class 1 and class 2 antigens are major histocompatibility antigens. MHC class 1 is recognized by the CD8 glycoprotein whereas MHC class 2 is recognized by the CD4 glycoprotein. So as we can see except option A and option E all the other options are not holding true for the given question and now let's come to the last question which of the following diseases are associated with the mutation of MHC class 1 genes now looking at the chart we can easily differentiate which of the diseases given in the options fall under the mutations of MHC class 1 gene As you can see other than option D that is ankylosing spondylitis all the other diseases fall under MHC class 2 gene mutations so the answer here is D